How to make a subscription website in Wix. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how easy it is to create a very beneficial website which is going to uh, get you some subscriptions or recurrent subscription for your uh, account. Uh, very easy. All you need to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning to the end and you are going to be good to go. For today's video, you need only to set up here a account on Wix and that's it for the first step. So you're going to head over to Wix.com, sign in for an account and here we have it. If you have already an account on Wix, you're going to get here the sites dashboard that will show you all of the websites that you have. So in case you don't have a website, you're going to see here the choice to use either Wix Studio or Wix simple editor. So we are going to select the normal Wix editor. And then we're going to get maybe the help of the AI if you want to select and set up your website dashboard. So I'm going to go without it. And now we are going to type in the uh, website that we want to create. So we are going to set up here subscription subscription and then we are going to see if we have some uh let's say mutual uh descriptions or titles like fitness subscription box food subscription box etc so maybe we are going to set up here makeup subscription box because we are going to set up some subscriptions or also cosmetics or or something like that then we are going to click on continue after that you are going to be preparing to your dashboard so make sure that you are going to mention subscription in the title or the type of the website because you are going simply to set up the subscriptions later and now we are going to set up for example the name of the store for example jack cosmetic now we are going to click on continue and after that you are going to see uh, what do you are going to do do you already have an online store no i'm just starting out or yes i already sell in online so i'm going to set it right as here so do you want to move an existing store to wix not sure and then we are going to set up the uh, products that we are going to sell so we are going to put up some print on demand products, maybe uh, physical products, digital products, for example, for uh, beauty books, magazines, etc., and some services. We are going to click on continue. How are you offering your product? So now we are going to see the online store, as you can see, and in person marketplaces and etc. So we are going to select that and click on go or continue to the dashboard. So now we are going to get the access to our dashboard. We have some steps that we need to complete. At least we have 10 steps or nine. You are going to set up here the payment methods, the shipping uh, profiles and adding the products. So as you can see here, we are going first uh, before setting that, we're going to click on design site. And after that, you're going simply to set up a design. So you can go ahead and generate a design with the help of the AI or you can customize a template. So let's go ahead and pick a template right there real quick and see the result of the templates. As you can see here, we have some best matches. We have this one subscription box company. It is uh, like the same uh, hero or the uh, purpose of our makeup subscription we are going to uh, sell you some subscription uh, boxes about makeups or cosmetics we have this also makeup store and etc so i'm going to use here the makeup store click on edit and then we are going simply to wait for the wix website editor to open up it will take a little bit of time from you to open up the website but it will not get that long so wait with uh, the process until it will finish so now we have finally obtained our website 
you can see here at the guide of the left side bar or the left side menu it will contain here the additional elements sections consultation exploration of pages and menus that you have on the website and a lot of features so i'm going to skip that and head over directly the website everything is ready some of the products are uh, waiting here these are some example products and etc so we are going to set up the uh, subscriptions how we can do that very simple so we are going simply right here to view the uh, apps so we are going to add apps which is the wix app market and then we are going to wait and search for the wix subscriptions we are going to type in wix subscription and we are going to wait for it so here we are going to see the uh, subscriptions normally so it will be uh, set in right there subscription so this is the uh, subscriptions uh, app from wix it is not called wix subscriptions anymore it is called wix pricing plans i thought that it was called uh, wix subscriptions but no worries all we need to do is to click on add to site install it then we are going to wait for it to open up here the fields of the plans now we are going to see it right there it will open up here the menu and also it will show up the model of the subscription for your page so usually it will be go ahead and set up the subscriptions so it is here the pricing plans page here it is we're going to console it consult it this is the uh three plans that are available so if you want to customize them you're going simply to click on the manage plan and it will open up here the dashboard of yours so make sure that you are going to start now click on it then you are going to complete the three steps you're going to create the first plan set up the payment methods and also upgrade with the plan that will let you accept payment so in my case i am only using the free plan of wix that will allow me to create some examples or some websites and design them uh, modify them edit them do whatever but only i cannot create some stores so we are going to create the first plan then you are going to name it here we have the first plan uh, you need only to set up at least three plans so as you can see here limit to one subscription per customer so we are going to move that now we are going to set up the plan for example basic for example basic and we are going simply to set up a description for it uh get a basic maybe a premium thing like that i have already created i think a uh premium plan or a payment plan right there but in another wix website but it doesn't matter so you are going to tell the customers uh, that are going to be available uh, or the main features right here so for example we are going to get for example premium access then you can add more so um, we are going to set up here uh, exclusive for example uh, products limited limited uh, uh, for example time product and etc so for the benefits you can go ahead and uh, see how to connect more benefits you can so go ahead and set uh, some booking services because here i will not use that because it is only a free subscription a recurring payment yes we are going to use a price of 39.99 as an example frequency of payment here we are going to set it monthly the length we are going to into cancel it and you can charge a setup fee or enable a free trial for example but i will not do that uh here don't forget to set up a, a card i'm gonna go ahead and use an image or select a card from there to make it appear so media from wix i'm going to add something uh, just really quick and we are going to add this 
Now you are going to see here the settings. You are going to allow customers to cancel the subscription. Yes. Let customer set a start date. No, you can add a privacy form here or collect additional uh, info at the checkout from here. Add a form and customize the thank you page by setting or editing that. These are the, this is the preview and you are only going to click on save and boom here we have created our first plan you're going to create a two to three plans so you are going simply to uh, modify this page and get them uh, be right there so as you can see here we have the basic plan it is shown right there and here we have the benefits of them so you can go ahead and modify the page appearances right there by setting up the setting not for that, but for the uh, quick edit of the page, we have here the background. You can see here, you can change also the layout or the uh, specificities right there of the fonts and etc. So that was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one.